One of the main themes of the short story is meaninglessness in life. You can see the old waiter grappling with this concept that life has no meaning as he is forced to close up early and leave his clean, well-lighted place. He expresses that it was a nothing he knew too well. The old waiter can be seen expressing empathy for the old man to whom he has a shared despair with and can understand in terms of dealing with the meaninglessness that life is. At the very beginning of the short story, him and the younger waiter are discussing how the old drunk attempted suicide a week before over quote-unquote nothing. In this situation, nothing is everything. It has become a consuming thought that cannot be fixed or forgotten about by anything, even plenty of money, to which apparently the old man has. It's then obvious that just as money can't buy you happiness, it cannot fix the idea of meaninglessness. Another main theme of Hemingway's short story is hopelessness. Dealing with the overwhelming idea of nihilism is an antecedent to having to deal with despair and hopelessness, again, particularly for the old waiter and the old man. It is reiterated throughout the story that to combat with such a notion, one must find their clean, well-lighted place. This is why the older waiter is so reluctant to close the cafe up early. He's fighting to keep both his and the old man's space of safety and comfort open. But just as everything else in life, what they thought would be their forever place of consolation turned into nothingness. For the young waiter, who sees the early closing through, his clean, well-lighted place is at home with his wife. But as it is made very clear in the story, he is oblivious to this meaninglessness and hopelessness that the other two characters feel. He's unaware that he is taking their version of a home and wife away from them. Though I wouldn't say that religion is a theme in this story, it does play a significant role in exaggerating the void that life is and really just accentuates another aspect of life that is meaningless. A huge part of meaning in a lot of people's lives comes from their belief system or their gods. For the older waiter, this is just another aspect of life that provokes a sense of nothingness in him. This is shown on page 5 as he repeats the Our Father while replacing the words with nada. The tone and language that Hemingway uses almost mimics the theme. He uses a very uncomplicated and somewhat monotone style of writing, a style that adds to the nothingness that the theme is trying to touch on. Life is not extravagant or embellished, just as Hemingway's language and tone in this piece. The characters in the story play a huge role in emphasizing the theme of the piece. The three different men represent three different stages of despair, denial being the younger waiter, a transition period being the older waiter, and finally acceptance represented by the old man. These stages and the themes are portrayed through their individual personalities, their current mental states, and their actions and what they do. The young waiter, as someone who is too busy living a youthful and full life, or perhaps living in denial, is carefree and blithe. He has no consideration for the old man or the older waiter, as he adamantly decides to close early. For the young waiter, he does not understand the importance of having a clean, well-lighted place to turn to, and probably does not even realize that his wife and home is his. The old man, on the other hand, is someone who has had much time to battle with this concept. At this age in life, he has accepted it and has learned to deal with it with dignity. What really stuck out to me about these characters was the sheer contrast. Firstly, in the complete opposite stages of life they are in, one in denial and the other in acceptance. And this dignity and patient carefulness the old man has is what the younger waiter lacks. This difference between them is shown perfectly as the old man drinks without spilling even now when drunk, while the younger waiter poured on into the glass so that the brandy slopped over and ran down the stem into the top saucer. The older waiter is in the middle stage of despair, stuck in between the young waiter and the old man. He's now discovering meaninglessness and hopelessness of life for the first time. His mental state appears to be nearly unhinged, especially as we follow him to the bodega and then home. He's now on his way to acceptance, and though he is somewhat spiraling and not yet dignified as the old man, he's in a place where he now understands what finding a clean, well-lighted place feels like, unlike the younger waiter. Before reading the short story, I thought that this song was about struggling with one's faith and the unsettling thought of being alone in the world. While that may be true, a clean, well-lighted place has helped me to understand the theme and message of the song in more depth. In light of Hemingway's piece, it's now clear to me that On Our Own has a similar theme. The narrator of the song is going through a similar transition phase that the older waiter is going through, only the song focuses on religion. The man in the song is wrestling with the fact that while some people's faith gives them strength to pull through, he accepts the world as a hopeless place and we're on our own. 
but he soon realizes that even though he is alone and that there is no higher being, he has to make the most of his dues. Just as the older waiter, the man in the song is trying to find his clean, well-lighted place. Throughout the song, he pinpoints multiple places of light that help him tolerate his crippling thought of being alone. One of the quotes from the song that I really reflected on after reading the short story was, I know the world is a beautiful place, but we're on our own. This truly ties in with the theme of the story that even though we are on our own and hopeless, the world still has so much beauty, you just have to find yours. The ultimate message that I got from the story was that in a world that seems so meaningless, it is crucially important to find your clean, well-lighted place, a message that is reflected in the song. Especially in recent struggles due to COVID-19, where mental health and the feeling of despair has become a pandemic in and of itself, we have gotten one extremely important life lesson out of it. We must take time to find the things that bring us light and hold on to them. Unfortunately, in the case of the old waiter and the old man, they did not get to keep their light forever. Their clean, well-lighted place turned into nothingness just as everything else does. That wraps up my presentation. Here are the lyrics if you want to see them. Thank you so much.